In this lecture, I am going to factorize x power 4 plus 5x square plus 9. So, let's see the answer. So, first you are writing the given x power 4 plus 5x square plus 9. So, this question there, we are going to use a plus b whole square. The formula is a square plus b square plus 2ab so this we can write x power 4 and here 9 plus 5x square so x is power 4 we can write x square whole square 9 we can write 3s square whole square and thereafter a square plus b square plus 2ab that means 2 into suppose this a this b x square into 3 that comes 6x square so this come here 6x square so after that so here 5x square and here 6x square so we can write here 2 into x square into 3 so this becomes 6x square but here so that we need to multiply or uh, subtract with the x square so if you calculate then that is equal to 5x square okay so x power 4 9 and here 5x square we can write this all now the next is so this here x that I assume a 3 that I assume b so this is a square plus b square plus 2 into a into b okay so this is equal to a plus b whole square that means x square plus 3 whole square and this here minus x square that right so in place of this we can assume a this so we can assume b so a whole square power square between minus so this we can write a plus b a minus b that means here x square plus 3 plus x the next is x square plus 3 minus x or we can write here x square plus x plus 3 and the next is x square minus x plus 3 so this is the final factorization of this polynomial so this uh, polynomial is uh, based on a plus b whole square and there we need to use a square minus b square so write the given then after write this and here x power 4 we can write this one 9 we can write 3 whole square 2ab 2 into a into b that comes 6x x square so for this here 5x x square this is there so we need to multi, uh, subtract with x square then that is equal to 5x square this is the based on the formula and use this formula here x square then next uh, we should use a square minus b square formula then a plus b a minus b and after doing that here you can get this so this is the way we can do the factorization of this polynomial. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.